back to Almond Arcade. Let's let's get into this horror game. <clears throat> man, I'm not looking forward to this. Oh man. Cat. My run energy never goes under ninety eight now. <sighs> Here we go. Here it comes. I suppose it's time to go home. I've had enough for today. Okay, we're gonna just do the any percent for going home. I do not feel like trying to go out of my way to find all the pages. Shit, I have something I kinda wanna do on fucking Skyrim now. Play Khajiit. Run quickly to, um... Like, quickly go to, um... Fuck, what's it called? Place where the Thieves Guild is. Riften. Um, quickly go to Riften, kill uh, the Fist guy, get his enchanted like uh, fist damage gauntlets, and then just be a melee based character. Or, but that uses only fists. And then just run through the whole game using just fists. And then just boost my enchanting like so fucking hard that like I have enchanted like heavy like armor gauntlets that just do incredible damage and then just do a full run of the game right. using I'm no weapons, them. just my fists. They are the only thing keeping me sane. Josh, I'm like, gonna have to ask you to stop spamming the chat. Cause like, so like Khajiits get bonus damage cause claws and then you get the enchanted gloves. Uh, the gloves of the pugilist, I believe that's what they're called. Um, get those up your enchanting. Then when you're ready, break them down. May uh, enchant some really good like Daedric gauntlets or something. Wear those. Then get the heavy armor perk for um, melee damage that scales with the armor of your gauntlets. And then that also stacks with your your passive like racial buff for your claws on your Khajiit character and then like you can go even farther beyond that you can just stack like like unarmed damage with like other enchantments like amulets and stuff and then just go fucking insane fight like <laughs> just take down like final bosses of the game and stuff like huge bosses just take them down with just your fists I think that'd be fun. I hate how I have to play this with both keyboard and mouse and fucking controller. And perhaps maybe even bring that a step further with like stealth. So have the melee stealth bonus, but utilize your fists. So you would have to have, oh shit. You could have an enchantment that makes it so that you're very stealthy all the time, or have illusion spells. Or no, it's not illusion, it would be um, alteration spells that make you completely silent. Who else is there? I heard someone join. Somebody else joined? Dang, I hear more white noise. Oh no. No, it's just me. I have the Discord open on my other monitor. Ah. I guess my white noise just went up a little bit. Or maybe it's the game, who knows. <sighs> God. Fucking, I had the sound turn off when I first played through this. Mm. I didn't realize how fucking ambient the goddamn music is. Mm. Oh, fucking thank you. Do not appreciate. <laughs> Have I ever mentioned that I don't like horror games? I I kind of enjoy horror games. You just get like a certain thrill from them that you don't get from other games. Though I don't appreciate Was that ones you? That are... Hold what? on, was oh. that you? Was no. that sound you? No? No. No. Fuck. 
All right. <laughs> Spooky. Great. Great. <laughs> Spooky, scary. Spooky, scary. Oh, man, this is going to fuck with me, isn't it? All right. I mean, it is a horror game. This is... I don't thoroughly enjoy horror games that feed off of, like, like jump scares. Because then the whole, like... The whole point of it is just like, oh, when it's gonna happen, I don't know. Oh, it's gonna be, it's gonna get ya. And then that's like the only thing about the game that actually like scares you. It's not like ambiance or like, or like just like storytelling or psychological shit. It's just fucking like, oh, there's the spooky man. You know, oh no! It's very, for this one, it's very ambient. Like in my opinion, Five Nights at Freddy's is probably the worst fucking horror game ever created. I disagree. Really? Well, to an extent. Um, for one and four, I disagree. Hmm. You're free to. I I I will happily agree with you on fucking. I mean, all stuff. of them really feed off of, like, the jump scare trend. You know what I mean? Yeah. I, I'm just not a fan of jump scares. I think I feel like they're a really shitty, like, payoff for, like, a horror scenario. It's like, oh, I got scared. Alright, whatever. Moving on. <clears throat> well, that's why I think 4 does it so fucking well. 4, uh... Five Nights at Freddy's 4 plays entirely off of, like, auditory. Oh, yeah, 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 because, yeah. um, yeah, be that's the one when you're the kid in the bedroom, right? Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah, and then you have to listen for, like, the sound cues. Yeah, that stuff's, like, kind of interesting. Five, Five Nights at Freddy's 4, I, I, I've i said is the best Five Nights at Freddy's game. But 3 is pretty neat. Or, no, not 3. 1 is pretty neat. Five Nights at Freddy's 1 was a new take on a on, on the genre. Oh yeah. I mean it was revolutionary when it came out for that type of game, but like after that it was just kind of feeding feeding oh, into for sure. that same thing. For like, sure. Two, then... two was two was horrible. I hated two. I like I played the first one, two... I was like, alright, whatever. And then two, two was is... just like two is way too stressful to be actually co uh, considered fear and then three is Pathetic. Just makes you angry. No, three is three is really pathetic. Can I can I just say this right here? Uh, it's hard to look at uh it's hard to look at Five Nights at Freddy's three, see what uh what what a spring trap does. Oh, and God. consider that a and consider that a jump scare. No, nah, he's just sliding into those DMs. <laughs> sliding into those DMs. Like it's Hey it's Mama, really can I get hard... your number? It's really hard to take it seriously. Yeah, jeez. Come on, open up. Okay, hello, eyes in the wall. Alright. I don't like that sound. At all. Alright. There's a lot of sounds I don't like. What's my opinion on Dead Space? I'll never play it. <laughs> <laughs> I've never played Dead Space, but I do own both Dead Space 1 and Dead Space 2, but I've never played them. Oh, no, okay, do not appreciate, alright, do not appreciate. Uh -huh. I think, I, in my opinion, I think a horror game that, that doesn't feed too much into the jump scare, like, phenomenon... And then, as well as, like, has, like, a good psychological horror, like, thing to it. I mean, the game's hella old, but Amnesia, The Dark Descent, like... Uh, Amnesia was, was downright fucking adored for that. Hi? 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 What the fuck was that? <laughs> um, okay. That didn't kill me. So I guess that's good. I think, um, like, a good portion definitely of, definitely like, did games, not appreciate. A good portion of, like, what makes horror games good is definitely good storytelling. 
And I mean, there's even games that aren't even horror games that, like, do have, like, yeah. that type of storytelling that does just, like, like, inspire dread in you. I definitely did not appreciate that. Like, uh... the story to Half-Life is very, like, it, it, it has that feeling to it, right? Yeah. Uh, Half-Life is, like, one of my favorite games of all time. Uh, there's still three more fucking levels. I don't like this. Do not appreciate. Luigi's Mansion is actually, like, surprisingly scary in some spots. Oh, yeah. It's just, like, it's got that, that, um, it's got that, like, ambiance to it that's just kind of like ooh it's a spooky mansion uh, like no what is it the final boss in particular actually really oh, yeah, got that, me yeah that's pretty fucking yeah it's a spook fest but other than that it's a very charming game I don't really consider it like mostly scary it has it's moments though and I'm very surprised that I ever had those moments to begin with I'll be honest, like, um, I think the part in Luigi's Mansion that mostly freaked me out the most, I don't know, there's just something about, like, babies that freaks me out. Oh, uh, fucking, uh, what is it, Chauncey? Yeah, I don't know, I don't like him. I don't like the boss battle, I don't like him at all, it just it freaks me out. Oh, uh, God, I do not appreciate what's to come. Alright. Do not appreciate. Alright. That is a little girl scream. No fucking thank you. Uh, Goodbye, see you later. <laughs> do not appreciate anything about this. There is just <laughs> no appreciation for this. <laughs> I'm exit. not okay. I, I can't exit. I have to go through the, the entire of this. I would so quit, like, right here, right now, if, if I wasn't trying to speedrun. Uh, but do not appreciate... Oh, boy. Oh, I don't like that! Hello! Hi, person, I'm like... Okay, I... Mmm, no, thank you! <laughs> I remember when I, like... Mm -mm -mm. I remember when I played... And beat like the entirety of um what's that game called? Spooky's House of Jump Scares in like one sitting. Yeah. That was interesting. I did not appreciate that knocking game. I would appreciate it if you cut it out. Alright. <sighs> Come on, drink the fucking beer. Yeah, <laughs> drink the fucking beer. Washing of the teeth. <laughs> All right, wash off some of that coal gay. Hi. <laughs> so the, get, get rid of that aqua fresh. Okay. Saturday. Uh huh. I don't like the fact that the sky is red. Can we not? Deal with this today. It's red Back because to... red is the color of blood. I think I'm going into a portal from hell, and I do not appreciate anything about it. That is You're an like evil bunny. Doodle. That is an evil bunny. Those, that is a giant evil bunny. I. 
Hi. Have you enjoyed evil bunnies? Because Minecraft. Hi. I mean, I kind of do, actually. <laughs> or giant, like, like demon marshmallows. That that shit's like straight up your alley. Yeah, that's it's kind of funny stuff. I do not appreciate though anything that I'm seeing today. All right, let's uh, open the door and. All right. I do not appreciate. <laughs> oh, hi, sir. Sir. Can Excuse me, you? sir. Do I have the Can time? I there we go. You know what? I just realized something. You can have shields and still do fist attacks. I forgot about that. Alright. Fuck, I just, I just, yeah, my, I'm stuck in a mindset. <clears throat> but I'm also horribly addicted to RuneScape like it's heroin. Probably. Is that you? Is that on your end? Oh, That's oh. Ass. Me vaping? Oh, okay. <laughs> the ambiance <laughs> of the vape is spooking you. Um, well, considering where I'm at in the game right now, and that my, uh, my, my whole apartment seems to have gone to hell, uh, quite literally. Get attacked by, like, a uh, vape monster. I, I have to, I have to make sure. Alright, well... Let's open the open the doors. If nothing, as if nothing's wrong with our apartment right now. You know, just uh, just come in, wash my teeth. You know, wash same old, same teeth. old routine. Same old, same old routine. Let me just wash routine. my teeth with a, some good old laundry detergent. Get some Dawn in there. All you right. know. All right, let's 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 go to sleep. Let's do let's do Sunday. Sing our way through the. What? What? Excuse me? Open the door? No? That's not it, is it? Okay. What door? Is it this door? <laughs> I... I can't watch. Oh. Oh. And it all- OH SHIT! Oh! Okay! Did you die? Did you brush your teeth too much and you died from <laughs> bleeding out from your gums? I guess that's- I guess that's the end. Huh. All oh, right. So seventeen thirty-nine. Seventeen thirty-eight. It's a very ambient game, but there needs to be it another ending. Very... There probably, there might be, but I ain't gonna go in here and check again. If you wanna, if you wanna go in and through through go, going home and and figure it out yourself. Feel free to do so. Oh, you're playing I ain't going playing home. This again. No, it's a game called Going Home on the fucking uh the Almond Arcade. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I've heard of that. I always I always yeah. thought it was a stand it was like a standalone title. It might be. When did Going or when did the Going Home that you're thinking of come out? Uh, hold on. Going Home uh game. Oh no, Gone Home is the one I'm thinking oh, of. Oh, yeah. You're thinking of Gone Home, yeah. No, yeah. Going Home, yeah, Going Home is a uh, is a game here in the, the Almond Arcade. It is the horror game of the game. And, again, if anyone wants to fucking play these games themselves and figure things out that I'm not gonna go through and figure out myself, like, especially in this game, especially in this fucking game, feel free to do so. It's a free game. It is a fucking free game. There is no excuse for you not to. <laughs> I'm not doing it, though. <laughs> I cannot deal with horror. No thanks. <laughs> I 
I, this is the one and only time I just decided to go through here so I could get an any percent run so there's a time to beat. Thank you. No thanks. <laughs> Put the almond arcade. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs>